Hi, I'm Jordan Banks. My time at RAP may not have been the prettiest picture so far, but it's about to get a whole lot better because we're going on a school trip. Bon voyage, baby. To Paris. You know, the one in France. Everything may look perfect at first, but... C'est la vie. Because when you're in a new country, with new customs and new food, everyone's going to feel like the new kid. Jerry, good morning. Jeff in Las Vegas. Good morning. I love your backdrop. Oh, thank you very much. Thanks for joining me talking about your new graphic novel, School Trip. Thank you. I'm excited. Well, my, my book, Bert, I'm very excited. Oh, well, I am too. Uh, Jordan, Drew, and Liam are back. Uh, what is the gang from Riverdale up to in your newest graphic novel? <laughs> well, this time they get to take a school trip to Paris. So they get to see places like the Eiffel Tower and the Picasso Museum and the Louvre and seeing Mona Lisa for the first time and eating croissants and seeing people eat frog's legs and escargot and just, you know, really learning about the culture where this time they're all the new kids. So the level, the playing field is pretty level this time. You know, I took a day trip to Paris a few years back. It can be overwhelming finding your way around. Uh, do the kids uh, get lost at times? Because I know I was confused. <laughs> oh, absolutely. Yeah, uh, they, they definitely get lost, especially since the teachers who they thought were going to be their chaperones, they're not their chaperones. So they're replaced by, by two teachers who really weren't expecting to go to Paris in the first place. So it makes the the uh the week a little bit less certain than it would have been you know I, I also experienced severe culture shock as well exposed to all new language new food how does the gang deal with all these new experiences you know it takes them a minute because the american way and the french way are very different you know i think we tend to rush a little bit more especially like i grew up in new york where everything was rush 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 and you go there and they say, okay, if you're eating lunch there, it's going to take like two hours. There's no like in and out, you know, you chew the food, you enjoy the food, you have conversation. And it's very different for them because they're used to wolfing down their food they're grabbing their food and, and walking. And, um, you know, they go by the Seine River and they, it's very hard for them to relax because I know it was very hard for me to relax. So I put a lot of that kind of stuff in there. But uh, by the end, they can kind of breathe. And there's a whole thing about stopping to smell the roses. It was funny. My One of my memories was going to the Louvre and seeing the Mona Lisa. I was And I was shocked to see that it was like almost the size of a postage stamp. I thought it would be something big and majestic. And it was quite small. And you couldn't even get near it. You know, So I thought that was pretty interesting, too. Yeah. The, and there's a scene where they go to see the Mona Lisa, too. So it's I say exactly that. <laughs> That's so cool. And New Kid and Class Act have been bestsellers. What kind of response have you gotten from middle schoolers? Uh, have you heard from? I mean, your fans, uh, do they, are they enthusiastic? Oh, yeah. With this one, um, see, with New Kid, that was the first one. So people weren't really expecting. Uh, they didn't know who I was at all. Class Act, it was better. And this one, the um, the fans are just like, chomping at the bit, which is wonderful. I, I'm so happy that kids who were not readers or teachers said that they've never read a book in their life until they read New Kid and then they read Class Act several times and they are asking them, bugging them on a daily basis when school trip is coming out. And that is the best compliment that I could ever get, especially from a former reluctant reader. I hated reading books. And now I would say that I make the books that I wish that I had when I was a kid that would have hopefully made me a reader. And I hope that uh, New Kid and School Trip and Class Act are those books. Well, Jerry, if you hated reading, you must be a math guy. You sound like a, a math guy when you were growing up. No, I was always an <laughs> artist. I always loved to draw. Oh, okay. And the reason I became a writer was that I needed to, to have stories to draw. So I forced myself to write my own stories. Oh. I just didn't like reading people's stories. I have math anxiety. I to this day I can't stand math, and I turned to reading and and science and and English. So I, I I dove into books. And what I love about your book too is also the illustrations. Can you tell us about the background on that? Yeah. Um. So again, I I always consider myself an artist, not a writer, until I was literally an adult, and uh, I draw it all digitally in Adobe Photoshop. Um. I had the fortune of going to Paris twice, once with some artist friends. 
And then once I took my own sons back and then kind of saw it through their eyes, which is really amazing uh, to actually sit there and sketch out things and take a lot of photographs. So there's there's a lot of research that went into it. Uh, but overall, it's a fun book. You know, the New Kid series is a loving mom and dad and loving friends and it promotes empathy and, and awareness and wanting to be a global citizen and respect, you know, each other, your parents, your teachers. So um, the, the kids love it. Teachers love it so i'm very fortunate to to have this new book and have people waiting to see it and can fans expect a book tour are you going to go out and greet your fans on 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 hit the country absolutely i leave today <laughs> so I, I don't even know where i'm going yet they just sent me a bunch of airline tickets so as i look i'm like oh okay i go on to st louis today okay where am i going i'm going to denver tomorrow <laughs> so i will um there it is on my website uh, jerrycraft.com so you'll see some of the places I'm going and probably till the rest of the year excellent well Jerry I know you got to get packing so I won't keep any longer so uh, <laughs> thank you so much for joining me today and uh, let's talk again soon thank you so much thank you